what is up YouTube it has been years since I've been on this channel and I'm back finally I don't know how long it's been too long and it feels good to be back I gotta be honest it feels good to be back I love YouTube as a great platform for fitness uh, content informative things motivational things as well and I thought why not come back and just so you know I've still been making some gains I've still been putting in work um, but I have some exciting news and I'm excited to be back here on this channel again uh, and back in the bodybuilding world. So right now, currently, I am three weeks out from my first natural bodybuilding competition for the year, for the season. It's been seven years since I got on stage. Seven years since I got on the natural bodybuilding stage. That right there is ridiculous. Like, <laughs> it makes me feel old, not gonna lie. But three weeks out currently, I started this prep about 20 weeks ago now. So three weeks out from the first competition and then I have a few more to look forward to, a few more exciting uh, events coming up. So in reality, I actually have the proper competition that I was planning to do in six weeks from now, right? So six weeks from now, or five, actually five weeks from now is when the first competition was supposed to happen. I created this goal, I wrote down this goal at the start of the year that I was going to win an overall in bodybuilding in the natural bodybuilding world. Basically, that means you have to win your division, the open division, and then you have to beat all the other winners for their divisions as well, and then you get the overall trophy. This is something I have not achieved before as a competitive bodybuilder, and I've had clients. My clients come to me, and they achieve these things. Now, obviously, I just haven't been on stage in such a long time, so I haven't really had the opportunity to do this. And back in 2020, I did start a contest prep, and unfortunately, due to the way the world was, uh, those competitions did not eventuate and I had to just pull out from that and to be honest coming away from that contest prep in 2020 and being so dedicated consistent excited and focused and then having to just end the prep cut it short and not achieve the goal that I had set out was not great it was not great I definitely went through a phase of uh you know, under, it was just underwhelming. Like I had this goal, I had this mindset, I knew I was gonna achieve a certain physique and do really well. So when that didn't eventuate, it was kind of, um, you know, demotivating in ways and I kind of lost focus in my bodybuilding pursuits. Went overseas, did some travel, had some fun, explored the world, so kept training obviously. And you know what, I came back to Australia and I wanted to have some clear, concise, specific goals and I decided to get back on the bodybuilding stage. So that's kind of how I've come full circle. It's been seven years since I was on stage and now I'm here three weeks out from the first comp. So my initial comp is five weeks from now and because I started my prep in a good spot and I feel like I'm in pretty good shape right now, I decided to do a competition earlier, you know, just get my feet wet, get back on stage, feel good, get used to the tanning, the posing, the prep work, all that kind of stuff, right? There's a lot that comes into a bodybuilding competition prep. So I'm doing my first show in three weeks, and then I am doing an IFBB competition, an IFBB, so classic physique uh, division, which I've never done an IFBB show before, so I'll be doing that two weeks after, so five weeks out. The very next day is the show that I initially planned on doing, which again is a natural show. Now, the first one I'm doing earlier on in three weeks from now, that is a qualifier for nationals, right? So I don't really have to do that initial competition that I was planning on doing because I'm doing the one ahead of time, which will qualify me for nationals, which is the main focus. The main focus is to win an overall in a natural bodybuilding competition and then go to nationals and win that as well and get what they call, I guess, Mr. Australia or ICN and become a pro, basically, a natural pro. So that's kind of what my goal has been, that's what my mindset's been at. Um, I wrote down these goals first week of January and in that period of time, I've just had this uh, epiphany, if you would call it that, where I'm like, hey, like these are tough goals. Don't get me wrong, these are very challenging goals and it's been a long time since I was on the bodybuilding stage. However, let's step things up and make it even more challenging for myself and get out of my comfort zone and that led me to getting onto or planning to get onto the IFBB Classic Physique stage. And that kind of snowballed into another idea of getting on stage on the WBFF stage, which I've never done before. And once again, I've had clients compete in these competitions and do really, really well. I've got clients who are pros in the WBFF. 
So I thought to myself, why not challenge yourself? You know, just step up and do the work. So at this point, I'm three weeks out, I'm five weeks out, and then I'm six weeks out as well from ICN, IFBB, WBFF. And then a week or two later will be the ICN Nationals, which I originally planned on doing, where I will hopefully achieve, definitely, definitely, I will definitely achieve um, my natural pro card as a bodybuilder. So that's what's been going on. That's kind of what I'm planning on doing right now. And I'm back on YouTube and I want to document some of this stuff. So I want to share with you guys some full day of eating videos, some training videos, some mindset videos as well. Pretty much anything I guess you guys seek motivation from or would like to see, I'm open to filming. So training, nutrition, mindset, fat loss, contest prep journey, posing videos, things like that. It's all going to be happening on this channel. So welcome back if you've been here before. Um, we're going to be very as consistent as possible and uh, share some more insights with you guys, keep you in the loop and take you on my journey to get my ICM Pro card, maybe IFBB and maybe WBFF as well. So we'll see how we go with these competitions. I'm excited for it. It's going to be really cool. And right now, um, you know, my excitement is high. My energy is low. I've lost quite a lot of body fat already, but we'll get into that in another video and I'll speak to you guys soon.